weekend too that we haven't had any rain. It's really been an ongoing theme is every single weekend so far this year we've seen precipitation. So far this stretch of the weather last three days has been dry. Not too bad and our temperature is not too bad as well. Lower 80s were our high today. 81 the official high in Columbia this afternoon. Tomorrow morning we'll be doing a partly cloudy skies. 60s to start things off and we'll be warm as we go tomorrow afternoon getting into the 80s once again. So let's talk about what we can expect over the next 24 hours. Winds out of the southwest right now and we're watching those showers and storms in North Carolina. The model right now I think overdoing the precipitation actually makes it in into our viewing area, but we can't rule out a couple showers late tonight across the region, mainly north of I-20. As we're waking up in the morning, that should be long gone. We'll be dealing with partly cloudy skies to start off your day with temperatures in the 60s, working towards the 80s in the afternoon. In fact, we're sitting in the lower 80s already by about lunchtime, getting into the middle of the upper 80s, and that's where we could see some showers and storms firing off across the Midlands. Something we'll have to keep an eye on as we go into those afternoon hours and early evening hours hours as well. Very summer like pattern with those pop up storms possible. Some of us will see the rain. Some of us will stay dry as you go throughout the next couple of days. We'll be mild as you go into your Monday night. So kids heading out to the school bus tomorrow morning, 65 degrees on the mild side. There could be some showers and storms though as they're heading home. Temperatures right around 83 degrees. Let's talk about going forward though. High pressure in place right now. Our wind out of the southwest. That's keeping us warm. And as you go into the beginning of the week, the warmest weather we've seen so far this year with temperatures likely in the lower 90s as you get towards Tuesday and potentially into Wednesday. But then another area of high pressure to our north starts to direct our winds from the north. It looks like as you go towards Thursday, a little bit of a cooler trend. When, when I say cool, middle 80s are going to be possible and then eventually 90s back in the forecast as we go into the weekend. So let's take a look at that 70 forecast, what we can expect going forward. High of 87 tomorrow up to 92 on Tuesday. That would be our first 90 degree day of the year with showers and storms possible. Each day after that, we're a little bit cooler, lower to middle 80s on your Wednesday and Thursday, but that doesn't last very long. That heat returning, we're into the lower 90s as we go into next week.